Hello, everybody. Welcome back. You got uh, me in the driver's seat, Ewan, and... I'm I'm Dave. You can call me Dave. Hey, he's Dave. Yeah. Yay. And today we're playing Naruto Shippuden Ultimate Ninja <laughs> Storm Generations. That is a mouthful. Mm -hmm. But there's a reason why we're playing. <gasps> is there? There's a request. Someone requested we play this again, so uh -oh. we will do. And we decided Ooh. to do story mode? Yeah... I think last time we kind of uh, just just blasted through it. Ooh. Tried to beat each other up. Yeah. Didn't work too well. So who will we play? Young Naruto Uzumaki? Regular? Or edgy? Um, That's the story you're picking, apparently. Yes. Just pick one. It doesn't matter to me. Ah, we'll play classic Shippuden boy. Because <gasps> he's Shippuden his pants. Can you skip it? Uh, of course I can. Oh, good. Yeah. We we don't want to have to deal with takedown notices. They shit. Uh, I'm just going to do a little the anime? skippy. I'm unsure. Don't want to risk it. <laughs> Sasuke Uch He's gone. Naruto having He's embarking, embarking on a journey. journey. Yep, okay. Returns at turning. Naruto Apparently part of the journey is climbing a wall. The leader of like Team you do. Seven. Yeah, honing your chakra. They go to the field and they fight. I got a feeling I'm gonna have to take the. There's oh. no way. So right. this is a super condensed version of all the other <laughs> games. Is it? Oh yeah, and the show. I wouldn't know because you just skipped everything. Uh, he went I, to train, came back. Watch the show. Oh, you did? No, no, I haven't. You haven't? No. Well, what did you begin. watch when you were younger? Sure as hell not this. Really? Yeah, I actually don't watch a lot of TV. Believe it or not, I play video games. <laughs> Who'd have thought? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> y you've seen my video game collection. I've also seen your show collection. That too. I was a Sony boy growing up. Ah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I played a lot of Sony games. I actually played a bunch of these Naruto games when they came out. Because I was a little nerd. <laughs> was. Am's a little nerd. Yeah. yeah. I played a bunch of the 2D ones and the 3D. And they're just fun. I can't tell what's going on. Ah, uh, it's okay. I'm just, uh, fighting boys. Fighting my sensei. Throw him into a tree. Yeah. What the? <laughs> now that's ramen. Gross. Do you realize those ramen bricks are actually two servings? Really? Yeah. That. <laughs> if you read the package, that ruins my life. I used to eat them constantly. Oh no, but it, I'm getting slapped. Like to make ramen, you're supposed to like add vegetables and some meat stuff and maybe like a raw egg if you want. Or cooked egg or, you know, not just noodles. Hmm. That's why it's two servings. Is that why they're split down the middle, sort of? Yeah. Kind of, not really though. <clears throat> that makes sense. Yeah. But, did you ever have TV when you were a kid? Yeah. Yeah? Not my own, but there yeah. was like two shared TVs. What was the best stuff that was on TV, like Saturday morning cartoons and such? What year are we talking? Um, when, when I was a kid growing up, it was like Family Matters and Ooh. Fresh Prince. Okay, Fresh Having Prince is still good. Naruto. Yeah. Um, Thus, uh, Full House. Like well, this is a long time ago. That is. Let's say and we're talking about like cartoons. Yeah. Into the wilderness. Yeah. What sort of the cartoons Kasekage did you watch? Has been uh, I grew up on the '80s Transformers. Sasuke's uh, and so Naruto. The Sonic the Hedgehog Saturday morning cartoons. Ooh. Chili dogs. Yeah. I never Way thought that's cool. You <laughs> You'll do me the favor. Hmm. I'm gonna take you out. Like, years after that was like a. Uh, Disney's One Saturday Morning on ABC. Mm, so it was like Gargoyles and Goof Troop and Bonkers and 
you know, all the fun stuff. is on Disney Plus. I kind of want to start watching it, but it's also not as good as. Wouldn't it be amazing if they remade that? It would be pretty good. But not like CG. But if they had like actual actors wearing like beefed up costumes, <laughs> just wailing on each other and flying around, Power Rangers style. Yeah. Because you've seen what they've been doing with a uh, uh, Mandalorian. Yeah. And that's all Muppets, and it looks great. It looks amazing. Uh, to diverge a little bit from uh, <laughs> the morning cartoons and such, oh. I want to talk a bit about Mandalorian. Um, no? You don't want to? Not really. Ah, uh, okay. People might have not watched it yet. Well, I just want to talk about, like, no spoilers. First or second, no spoilers or anything. I just want to talk about, like, the set design and stuff. Because I've found it really entertaining to just see all that stuff. I've only watched one. Eat every episode once so far. More As have I, but... Oh my god, some of the set pieces are just amazing. Though, a few of them, it does look a little odd, because uh, you see, like, the spaceship going through an area, but it looks a little out of place compared to the scenery they were filming. Yeah. You're like, uh... You almost had me fooled there. Nearly. So, a lot of the sets, like the, the backdrops and backgrounds and stuff, are actually projected backgrounds they have a great big lcd behind them and it's all 3d rendered oh, so, so it's neat. so the actors like, can actually see where they're walking around in so when they're not sh filming on like a having driven yeah they could just like turn the tv away, off and it's just black battle, oh and, and come that's pretty neat it's not green screen with... yeah it's good that they're finally moving past green enemy. screen because yeah it's kind of hokey however, and it takes a lot of like rendering and so yeah and downtime I guess you're not doing much rendering at all if you're just projecting it all on a screen behind them. Yeah, they're huge friggin' LCD TVs. And apparently it's all running uh, Unity in the Unreal yeah. Engine. So they can like edit it in real time and like add new props and stuff. So they're like, oh, this scene looks a little bare. Let's add a couple more things. Yeah, let's put a big friggin' boulder here. That looks fine. Like, oh, continuity is a little in. off because uh, in the later scene we had other stuff added in. Let's change the time of day or add a planet in the sky or, you know, maybe some cloud cover. Yeah. Or a character that perhaps wasn't... Uh, or a CG character walking by or maybe, like, make a crowd bigger or whatever. Yeah. That is so cool. Yep. I've also really enjoyed the uh, puppets. And costume designs. There's a lot of new characters in it. Like, for background characters. Yeah. The fan fiction is going to be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can probably get a lot out of the show, or even more, if you've uh, read the books and stuff. Oh, I hate this guy so much. He's always such a pain to fight. Because he's all ranged. I don't like how it put you in the background. Like, the camera didn't change? Uh, come on, you... Yeah, big ol' Muppet. Fight me. He's throwing firebirds at you. That's weird. They're explosive not firebirds, birds. they're explosives, yeah. yeah. Where does he keep them all? In a mouth in his, uh... hand. Oh, it is... Birds. It has a tongue that sticks out. He's just full of birds. <laughs> He's a bird man. He's just a, a stack of birds. <laughs> just big stack of birds, man. Yeah. And spiders, apparently. Yep. Gross. Everything that explodes. There we go. Whack him with yourself. Just whack him. <laughs> Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. Ew. <laughs> I'm hitting you with myself, but it's not me. So it's okay. So back to cartoons. Uh oh. Uh, was there a huge selection on the TV, or were you like limited to uh, whatever was just. For the longest there. time, we had like over the air stuff, and then we had like the basic cable, which was like 13 channels. And then finally, we moved into like satellite TV in like. Mm, I'd say early 2000s. Having defeated okay. Data. Up until then, you probably just had like VHSs you would watch over and over or whatever. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, remember I had video games. In 1995, I got my PS1. 
Yeah, that's a lot better than what we chesses. Reports have but what really Imagine if someone recorded Let's Plays on VHS. You could have. I know. It's so weird that nobody did. It was just reserved for stuff like uh, competitions. Yeah. It's like, oh, we gotta record everyone going against each other or whatever. Up until recently, a lot of websites with like uh, speed runs and such, mm -hmm. they didn't fact check the results people would send in. Let the battle begin. So, oh yeah, the uh, the quote unquote cheater for um, how we came was it Donkey Kong? Yeah, because they were getting scores that were Not impossible. Possible, yeah, or it's like they would just submit scores for random stuff. Where it's like, okay, why is there a two in your result when it only goes up by fives? Why are you a furry? Uh, angry fox spirit inside him taken over because he's very upsetty. Yeah. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Power of friendship and all that. Um, friendship is ninjas? Yeah. Okay. Pretty much. I think I spoke of snakes. He is a snake, sort of. Kind of. A spirit animal. He's also a furry. Uh, a lot of them kind of are. Kind of. Dude's literally a fox. And blah 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 blah. blah. <laughs> Boing. He did the worm. <laughs> hey, you win. He's a little slappy. You did it. Oh, I used to watch this show on... I think it was YTV. Oh yeah, from... Um, out of Toronto? Yeah. yeah, I believe I watched it with my aunt who corrupted me with anime and manga. Oh, you poor at an thing. Age. You poor thing. Yeah. You see, the thing was, she showed me this stuff before I could feasibly watch it on my own because we didn't have TV oh. for years. <laughs> so by the time we got TV, they stopped airing that stuff on uh, Canadian television. You know what? Having witnessed we have to pick Naruto's it up in the next one. Yep. Alright. Goodbye. His rage Bye. Quelled.